Hey guys, we're doing some T-pad work today. Hold up. Directing yourself down the tee pad is one of the most important aspects of having a consistent driving game in disc golf. Today I want to talk to you guys about having a smooth X step, lining yourself up on the tee pad, and then finally directing yourself down the tee pad for a successful throw. First we need to talk about what an X step is. An X step is the fundamental footwork that moves you down the tee pad and sets you up to throw your shot. When you're practicing your X step at home, try to think of it as one step at a time guiding yourself down the tee pad, taking controlled steps, allowing your body to get in sync with your feet, and allowing yourself to guide yourself in control to your release point. Now that we've got control of our X step, let's work on setting ourselves up on the tee pad before the throw. When I'm setting up on the tee pad before my shot, I like to start at the front. The reason I start at the front is because this is where my shot will finish, and this is where my release point will be. Now where I line up on the tee pad before my shot depends on the shot shape that I have in front of me. For a straight tee shot, I line up in the middle of the tee pad. Once my aim is set, I move straight back down the tee pad to prepare my run. I keep my eye on my target as I back down the tee pad. It helps me keep a straight line and stay focused on my tee shot. For an Anheuser shot, I start in the left corner of the tee pad. As I back down the tee pad, I end up in the opposite center. I have now created a line on the tee pad that complements the Anheuser. You may end up near or off the edge of the tee pad. It's okay to start off the pad. Just make sure you have good footing before beginning your X-Stop. Setting up a hyzer line is the opposite of an Anheuser. Begin in the right corner and back into the left center. You will have created a straight line for your hyzer shot. Remember to keep your eye on your line as you back up so you can create that line on the tee pad. We now have our new spot on the tee pad. The next step is to execute our smooth X step down our line on the tee pad to our release point. Now we're ready to throw. Using our controlled footwork, we can return to our aiming point at the front of the tee pad and throw the shot on our line. With practice, you will be able to navigate yourself down the tee pad like a pro. Remember that your steps should be moving you in a straight line back to your target at the end of the tee pad. I hope my tips for a smoother X-step and moving yourself down the tee pad will help improve your tee pad game.